Ecco. Ah! I'm Austin Jones, and I'm here at a lookout tower in the Washita National Forest, up in the clouds. I'm Austin. This is day 11, and I am Austin. I'm Austin. This is summertime snowball. I'm Austin. This behind me is the Cimarron River. Rock on. I'm Austin. I'm Austin. I'm Austin. Ten four, good buddy. I'm Austin. Je suis Austin. I'm Austin. I'm Austin. And this is the Rio Grande Canyon. Issy. I'm Austin. And this is Pete's Hole, Utah. I'm Austin Jones. And this is Brazos Peak. I'm Austin. And this is Needles Overlook, Utah. I feel much better. I'm Austin. It's day 18, and I'm ready to check out Moab. How about that? <laughs> I love it! What a beautiful fish! I'm Austin Jones! I'm Austin. This is Utah. I love it. Austin. Hi, I'm Austin, and this is the Black Rock Desert of Northern Nevada. But it's not the fact that it's black that makes it beautiful, it's the fact that it's a desert. I'm Austin. I'm Austin. I'm Austin! This is Western Oregon! I'm Austin. I'm Austin. I'm Austin. I'm Austin, and this is the Tillamook Cheese Factory. I'm Austin, and this is a Depot Bay. It's like I was just given birth to by a mountain. Woo! I am Austin. Next stop. Who knows? <laughs> Coastal Oregon. Do it. Do it. I'm Austin. Do it. I'm Austin. I am Austin. And this is day 26. I'm Austin. I'm Austin, and I camped with the clouds last night. Yar, hi, be Austin. So bright. I'm Austin. This is the Strait of Juan de Fuca. Juan de Fuca's up with that. I'm Austin Jones. Come with me on a journey. For the next 30 days, I'm going to be traveling from Atlantic Coast here in St. Augustine, Florida to the Pacific Coast in upstate Washington on $25 a day. Just me, my wits, and my trusty Steve. How do I plan to get it done? I'm going to camp in the National Forest, fish for most of my food, and basically do whatever I want for as few bones as possible.
So, $25 a day for 30 days. That's $750. It'll take more than two-thirds of that in gas just to get me and the old girl here to the West Coast. So with that having been said, how am I going to take care of other serious life functions like eating, sleeping, and controlling the old body odor? Well, let's just say a country boy can survive. I've learned a few tricks over the years as to how to do things on the cheap. Let's see if I can do it and share them with you.